People across Colorado are coming together so students in need can enjoy and learn the importance of music at school. The annual Bringing Music to Life Instrument Drive is happening now. They need your help. Our Sean Chitness live at tonight in Denver to really explain how this all works. Sean? Well, Dominic, this is the My Music School in Denver, one of several locations across the state that is collecting these used instruments you no longer need. Instruments, of course, are very expensive, and so they can make a huge difference if you donate them in helping those kids who need them. So far, the drive has been running for nine years already. They have collected 4,200 instruments and donated them to 200 different schools. Learning music is about a lot more than playing notes and scales. A one-time donation has the potential to make a lifetime impact on students across Colorado. The kids we're trying to help usually don't have access to them. They can't afford to rent or buy them. For almost a decade now, the Bringing Music to Life Instrument Drive tries to help more kids in our state learn music. It really gives them a lot of different life skills. Today, the executive director of the drive, Steve Blatt, was at this My Music School location picking up a few donations. Yumi Ha has supported this effort with her business for four years. Music has been, you know, one of those things that just gives such, such a, a value and a lasting impact for kids as well as adults all the way up to seniors. But because of the snowstorm this week, they're off to a slow start. They're hoping donations pick up in the second week of the drive. The weather did get in the way. The, uh, the big blizzard uh, impacted at least a couple of days of the drive near the beginning. Organizers say not only does music give students something to look forward to in school, it helps them succeed in other classes and gain more confidence. We've seen kids literally thrive because of taking part in music. It really does a lot for the kids. So all types of instruments are helpful, especially those you know would be in band or orchestra for students at school. Now, even if an instrument is damaged, they will repair it and make it go to good use for one of those students in need. 16 different locations across the state, and this instrument drive runs till March 23rd. Live tonight in Denver, Sean Chitness covering Colorado first. All right, Sean, thank you. Let's get a